This is going to be the collective energy reading for the star sign of Aries. Aries, as I meditated on your energy, what I heard was, the last shall be first. Okay? Let's get into the channeled messages and then we'll get to the tarot. Aries, in the month of June, you may be dealing with a friend, okay? This friend is coming up as a feminine energy and they may be spiteful over something that happened in the past or something that's going to happen. This person is not holding them themselves accountable for something that is going to occur or something that has already occurred. The spirit of the Ascendant Masters is urging you to stay out of the way of this person's karma. If you step in trying to model yourself with the desire of trying to save this person from their karma, you will also partake in it. It is important for you at this time to stand your ground and remain classy in this situation. Messages for Aries. In the month of June, Aries, you have a secret admirer and someone wants to romance you. You may be finding out who this mystery person is. Perhaps this is someone ha who has been keeping a close eye on you and you didn't know or you were none the wiser that this person even felt this way about you. And in the month of June, this person's going to let it be known that they choose you. Aries, be mindful that this person may have some sexual kinks that you may not be accustomed to, or you may be exploring some things with this person if you choose to partake that may be outside of the norm of what you're used to. Okay. For some of you, Aries, there are some very strong notations of spiritual warfare here also. You have beauty spells and wound magic. Both of them came out in reverse. So whatever these people are intending to block for you or inflict upon you will not touch you. This may come as a pleasant surprise to you. For others, it's just another day at the office. You see, Aries, there's something very significant about your spirit. You have an ancient soul is what's coming out here. There is a new you emerging. Perhaps the way that you communicate with others is going to further solidify this new version of yourself. There's going to be a pleasant surprise that may be coming in in the month of June that is going to develop into a life-changing opportunity. You may have come across this opportunity through your network or some kind of situation regarding the 11th house, which is blessings, networking, and communication. Or you may be dealing with an Aquarius. There may be someone that is going to communicate something to you very soon, Aries, and this person doesn't want you to tell anybody. Or there may be a dynamic in the month of June where you may come into some intel and someone wants to keep you quiet about this intel. In regards to the spiritual warfare, whether it's from this feminine friend or someone else, your ancestors are at their neck. So much so that you may feel little to nothing in regards to these attacks. 
You also received the Eternal Gatekeeper card. 32 may be significant, deriving to 5. Your gate, i.e. your position, is very important at this time. So stay focused and acknowledge, assert, and protect what is right for you. It's definitely giving goddess energy. Let's go ahead and tap into the channel. We'll clarify some things here. Let's get some energy on this <clears throat> spiteful friend. For Aries, please. Spiteful friend. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Okay. You got Eight of Wands and the Hanged Man. This person could be a fire sign like yourself, Aries, or this person could be a Pisces. They may be communicating and judging your communication or judging the fact that you're not communicating with them anymore. For some of you, this is an earth sign. For others, this is a Pisces. They may feel that this is due to some kind of elevation or ascension process you're going through or development. This person may be under scrutiny or they may be receiving karma for something that they did to you in the past that... They kept quiet about, they collaborated, or there may be a king of pentacles here that doesn't want to collaborate with this person anymore because they found out what this friend said or did to you. This person is going to be receiving karma because of it, and yet as they face this karma, they still don't want to take accountability for the role that they played in some kind of past transgression. Aries, it's also important for me to note that if you have been experiencing upsets in your sleep, it's because your guides are working overtime to protect you from some kind of energy work. These disturbances shouldn't be alarming to you. Just make sure that you get proper rest. As you are fighting the unseen at the moment, in the month of June, Make sure you appreciate the divine realms for assisting you in regards to this great undertaking. Clarifying the gatekeeper is the queen of wands in the upright. There's definitely a transformation process coming here in regards to work. Eight of Pentacles. You are manifesting a new beginning. You may be hearing something about work. Okay, for some of you, if you've been looking for a job, you may be finding your dream job or an opportunity to collaborate or work on something that you're passionate about in the month of June. A new you is emerging and very soon. Let's clarify that. Mm. your intuition there may be an air sign Gemini, Libra, Aquarius that wants you to stay quiet about something you may be receiving communication from this person very soon or sometime in the month of June okay this person may be wanting to come in and offer you a cup Ace of Cups, Temperance, okay? If this person is in an air sign, this person could be a water sign or a Sagittarius. But it's giving Aquarius energy. A new you is emerging is clarified by the star, okay? There is definitely an elevation process happening for you in the month of June. This is also giving the energy of influence, Focus on your healing also at this time as you continue to heal, Aries. This assists in your development. 
Let me get one on you have ancient soul. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Mm. The reason why your energy is so powerful in general and more specifically in June is because of your spirit. Okay? Whatever someone tried to do, whether that was siphon off of your spirit energy or your soul energy, this is going to backfire. Okay? Your ancestors are driving these practitioners crazy. For some of you, this is quite literally. They're wrapped up in illusions. They're confused. Okay? They're confused over how you achieve this Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. Okay? They're trying to understand how this is not phasing you. Let me get one on this secret admirer. For Aries. Hmm. You may meet this person at work. Three of Pentacles. This could be someone that you work with or this may be tied to some kind of new contract or job that you're getting. Mm-hmm. You know that this is going to be a victory for you. Six of Wands and the High Priestess. Whatever this job is, if you're not meeting this person at this new job, okay, then this person may be assisting you in getting a job or give you a good reference. Or this could be someone who knows someone. If I'm hearing, I know a guy. Okay, so this person may be putting in a good word for you at a company or with a company to hire you. Hmm. This could be for a long-term job or a contract. There's something here about three of pentacles. This person could be planning on how to approach you. Someone is definitely feeling betrayed and heartbroken over how happy you are in the month of June, Aries. They're also upset at the fact that you are manifesting opportunities for yourself. This person wanted you to juggle or be stuck. This person wanted you to lose something. Okay, you got the strength card and the four of wands, but that ain't happening. Okay? These spells, beauty spells, womb magic is getting clarified by the two of pentacles. This is backfiring. Your energy is too strong. And whatever this spiritual warfare is, is getting clarified by the world card. There's going to be an end to this cycle of having to constantly battle these people in secret or energetically. Hmm. Solutions are within reach, Aries, in the month of June. Perhaps you've been working diligently on trying to develop yourself and look for new opportunities and that's exactly what's coming in for you in the month of june so stay focused and don't get distracted because the opportunity is just around the corner for some of you you already have come into this for others you may be still waiting three of wands but this is also because of some other situation that is occurring, possibly regarding a legal situation or the government for some of you. Someone may be wanting to offer you something, but they don't know if you're going to accept this contract 
It may not be ideally what they know that you deserve. So, if that's a concern for you, I'd say overlook the options and don't sell yourself short. Mm -hmm. There's going to be new information coming in that possibly was supposed to be received a long time ago, but it was blocked, okay? Whatever this new information is, it's going to be good energy for you, okay? Whoever this karmic friend or feminine, whoever this spiteful energy is, they're jealous, which is why they did whatever they did in the past. They could be upset that this wealthy individual, King of Pentacles, is desiring to work with you or collaborate with you or do something with you, okay? This person no longer wants to play this game with this Piscean or whoever this is, whoever this friend is. They possibly played a role in trying to set you up, but this backfired. You're definitely pushing past barriers for victory. This person may be trying to figure out why you stopped talking to them. And the truth of the matter is, is because you know without a shadow of a doubt that your vibrations don't match with this person. Okay, this person's toxic. They're wishing that they could start over with you, but they can't, which is why you need to just move forward. This person is really a hater, Aries, and that's just the truth of the matter. Yeah, whoever the secret admirer is, they definitely want to come spoil you. You could be very independent, right? But Aries, you work hard. You've had to endure a lot. Maybe in the month of June, accept it gracefully. Because if anyone deserves to be spoiled, it's you.